It is back to school time, which means easy and healthy meals are in high demand. At least they are in my home. So let's make a really fun recipe today that's sure to please the pickiest of eaters. Stay tuned. Hi there, my name is Katrina. Welcome to the Organics channel, where we are passionate about bringing you healthy recipes every single week to keep you inspired in the kitchen. Today we're going to be making a back to school cinnamon carrot pasta. Let's begin by adding three roughly chopped up carrots to your food processor. Pulse five to six times and then let it run for just a few seconds until your carrots are finely chopped. Now we are ready to cook up your preferred gluten-free pasta. Cook your pasta a minute or two, less than the directions say, so that the pasta keeps a firmer texture, otherwise known as al dente. Once your pasta is cooked, dip out just a little bit of the pasta water and set it aside, and then drain out the remaining water. To your hot pot, add in four tablespoons of either butter, ghee, or vegan butter. I like using the Kerrygold brand butter as it's made from grass-fed cows. Next, add in the juice from one lemon. That's about three tablespoons worth. One half of a teaspoon or more of pink Himalayan or sea salt, and one half of a teaspoon of Ceylon cinnamon. Stir together your ingredients until the butter is melted. Now we are ready to add in your chopped up carrots and the drained pasta. Toss everything together to coat well. If your pasta is a little bit too sticky, just add in one tablespoon of the reserved pasta water at a time until you reach your desired consistency. And now for my favorite part, let's see how it tastes. It is so fun. Look at all the brightness of the carrots. Such a fun color. I love the flavor. It is so fun. Just the cinnamon and the lemon. Such a fun, bright dish. So some things that you could add to it, if you would like to add in some more protein, you could top it with some chicken or turkey, or maybe even shrimp would be really fun with the lemon juice, something fun to play with. But my daughter does not like cooked carrots. So I love that the carrots aren't cooked. They're just chopped really, really small, really easy to eat. Great way to get those veggies in. I hope you give this one a try. This is super fun. Thank you so much for joining me today. Hey, be sure to follow us each week for a new healthy recipe. Take great care of yourself and I'll see you in the kitchen. Bye-bye.